Ms. Hurd's general mental status, I very specifically um, was assessing to determine whether post-traumatic stress disorder was present, and it was not. How do you know that? From multiple information sources, right? So I was integrating the interview, my review of the data, the case records, other people's testimony, her treatment records. I also conducted the clinician-administered PTSD scale, the CAPS-5, which is the gold standard PTSD assessment. As a result of applying those protocols, what did you conclude? Ms. Hurd did not have PTSD, and there were also pretty significant indications that she was grossly exaggerating symptoms of PTSD.